the human body is a complicated living system with various intriguing qualities and abilities. Only when we take the time to learn our biological makeup will we truly appreciate how amazing and complex the human body is. Here are 19 interesting facts about the human body that will blow your mind. Number 1. Human bodies contain small traces of gold. You are actually richer than you realize. The human body comprises several elements, including gold. On average, a person weighing 70 kilograms would have 0.2 milligrams of gold. If this trace amount of gold is formed into a solid block of refined gold, it will measure 0.22 millimeters in width. Gold is essential for joint health and maintenance. Furthermore, because it is an excellent conductor of electricity, it aids in transmitting electrical impulses across the body. Gold can be found in several different places. These include the brain, heart, blood, and joints. Number 2. Babies' brains are wired to see faces and places. According to a recent study conducted by psychologists at Emory University, a baby's gaze is drawn to faces within hours of birth. Brain scans of infants have now shown the neurobiology that explains this behavior. The scanner which compared the innate fluctuations of the brain for both the adults and baby showed that the two regions of the visual cortex linked with face processing, and the two networks associated with places, fired in unison in both adults and babies. This skin proves that a baby's brain is more adult-like than we would love to assume. Number 3. The brain is the fattiest organ. We all know the brain is a unique and complex organ. It is involved in controlling body organs, our thoughts, speech, memory, and actions. However, while it is well known that the brain comprises various nerve fibers and arterioles, many people are unaware that it contains a lot of fat. With an average fat content of 60%, the brain is the fattiest organ in the human body. But in terms of weight, lipids, fats, account for 10 to 12% and water makes up for the remaining 77%. Number 4. Dead people get goosebumps. Perhaps the most shocking fact on the list, the dead get goosebumps. That is so crazy, like in a zombie movie. Dead people get goosebumps, however, not in the manner that living people do. Scientifically, goosebumps are tiny bumps on the skin that grow at the root of hairs. In living people, goosebumps naturally appear where there are hair follicles. For goosebumps to occur, microscopic muscles beneath each hair follicle tighten or flex, causing the hair to stand up and goosebumps to form. However, in a dead person, goosebumps are caused by rigor mortis. Rigor mortis is a decomposition process that occurs after a person dies. It causes the muscles in the body to tense and harden. These small muscles just beneath the hair follicles also contract. When this happens, the dead person's hairs stand on end, giving the appearance of having goosebumps. Number 5. Like fingerprints, everyone's tongue print is different. Did you know that each person has a different tongue print? Our tongues, like fingerprints, have distinct identifying characteristics. Not only is the tongue one of the strongest muscles in the body, but it also has the unusual property of having distinctive prints, just like each individual has distinct fingerprints. This multipurpose organ, primarily responsible for speech and taste, carries geometric shape information and unique physiological texture information that may be employed in the identification process. Number 6. Sneezing while traveling at 60 miles per hour makes you close your eyes for 50 feet. When you sneeze, your eyelids close for a split second. While stationary, the few moments when sneezing seems like the blink of an eye, but while driving at 60 miles per hour, your eyes will be closed for about 50 feet. No matter how mind-blowing that is, it is extremely dangerous for the road. Studies have shown that temporary loss of vision due to sneezing while driving caused approximately 2,500 vehicle accidents in the United Kingdom each week. Number 7. People don't sneeze in their sleep. 
I know most of you will feel this is wrong, however, according to science, it isn't. If you've ever felt like you sneezed in your sleep, it's most likely because you haven't yet slipped into a deep slumber or you're just waking up. It is thought that you couldn't sneeze when sleeping, because the nerves that let you sneeze are also at rest while you sleep. This is especially true as you approach rapid eye movement sleep periods. REM sleep causes you to be unaware of tickling or unpleasant sensations that would normally transmit nerve signals to your brain, causing you to sneeze. Hence, the reason why we don't sneeze in our sleep. Nonetheless, researchers are still attempting to figure out why this reaction occurs and how it is repressed when you sleep. Number 8. The tongue is the only muscle in the body attached from one end. Taste and chewing are the fundamental physiologic functions of the tongue. The tongue also aids in the creation of speech and sounds. But besides that, there are other fascinating facts about the tongue many don't know about. One interesting fact is that the tongue is the only muscle not attached to bone at both ends. It is only connected on one end to the hyoid bone. The hyoid bone is also quite unusual because it is the sole bone in the body that is not joined to any other bone. The hyoid bone and the tongue are indeed the ideal couple. Number 9. Sleep literally cleanses your brain. One of the most intriguing recent discoveries is that the human brain has a waste disposal mechanism. Brain cells, like people, require food to function correctly, primarily absorbing oxygen and sugar. And, much like with people, meals produce waste that must be cleaned. The brain's waste management system, also known as the glymphatic system, is a network of tubes that transports fresh fluid into the brain, mixes it with the waste-filled fluid in the brain cells, and then flushes the mixture out of the brain and into the circulatory system. This self-cleansing process generally happens during profound sleep. Number 10. Humans specifically have eyes that face forward to see in 3D. Relative to species with eyes on the side of the head, humans and other predators have forward-facing eyes, which limit their field of vision. But why would we give up this panoramic view? Well, this evolution gives the human eye the skill to identify variations in the depth of objects. In a nutshell, humans have forward-facing eyes for observing in 3D. Our visual system is very good at detecting depth. We can detect depth variations as tiny as a single human hair with the collective strength of our two eyes. This inherent ability to see the environment in accurate and vivid binocular depth is increasingly being exploited by modern technology. Number 11. Humans can't taste food without saliva. The tongue is a muscle that contains sensory cells, glands, and fatty tissue that aids in the moistening of food. But without saliva, humans won't be able to taste food. For taste, molecules in food must first mix in saliva. Once dissolved, the molecules are detectable via taste receptors. As a result, without saliva, you will be unable to taste food. For example, the taste buds will not sense if salt is applied on a dry tongue. When saliva is introduced, the salt melts, and the taste experience happens. Number 12. Your nails grow at the same time as continental plates drift. Moving a few millimeters at a time, it took hundreds of millions of years for the ancient supercontinent Pangaea to break apart into the landmasses we have today. According to scientific facts, albeit slow, this breakup was caused by tectonic plate movement. Do you know that tectonic plates move around a millimeter every week, the same rate at which your nails grow? Facts like this do make you wonder, for all we know about the human body, there's still so much shrouded in mystery. Number 13. Humans shed 35 kilograms of skin in their lifetime. You'll be shocked at how much dead skin you'll lose throughout your lifetime, regardless of whether your skin is flaky or as soft as a baby's bum. According to a 2011 study that was published in the journal Environmental Science and Technology, we lose 0.03 to 0.09 grams of skin per hour. That may seem like next to nothing, but it mounts up during your lifetime to about 35 kilograms, 
or about half your body weight. These dead skins are usually found in the form of small flakes, which constitute a significant portion of house dust. So now you know where house dust comes from. Number 14. Our sense of smell and taste decreases by 20% to 50% during flights. If you've noticed that the food served by airlines is dull or unappealing, it's not entirely their fault. Basically, you lose your regular sense of taste at the airport boarding gate. When you board a plane and fly thousands of feet in the sky, the flavor of anything from a pasta meal to a sip of wine is modified in many ways that we're only starting to comprehend. At 30,000 feet, our ability to smell things decreases due to a lack of moisture, which influences how we perceive the flavor of food. Lower air pressure in the plane also affects our taste bud sensitivity at the same time. Number 15. Two parts of the human body never stop growing. As far as we know, the human body develops consistently from the moment it is a fetus until it stops growing in adulthood. However, two body parts continue to develop till we grow old and die. These two body parts are, the nose and the ears. When other body parts start to grow slowly and then stop growing, usually after puberty, the nose and ears grow in size, leading the nose and ears to become more prominent. Number 16. During your lifetime, you will produce enough saliva to fill 50 bathtubs. Saliva is naturally found in the mouth and primarily helps with digestive functions. Because we constantly swallow and reabsorb the saliva, it is mainly recycled rather than produced. The saliva has a flow rate of around 30 milliliters per hour, a bit more when we're eating and less when we're sleeping. That's a wine bottle full daily, or 20,000 liters in our lifetime. In other words, 50 bathtubs full to the brim with saliva, Number 17. Most people fart around 14 to 23 times a day. Farting or flatulence is a medical word describing the release of gas from the gastrointestinal system via the anus. It is a typical process that occurs when gas builds inside the digestive tract. It can also occur when we eat or drink and swallow air. Gas is typically composed of nitrogen, oxygen, hydrogen, carbon dioxide, and, on rare occasions, methane. According to the National Institutes of Health, people release flatulence 14 to 23 times daily. In some cases, it might be more and this excessive flatulence can be caused by illnesses such as celiac disease, irritable bowel syndrome, and gastroparesis. Certain foods may also cause you to pass wind more regularly. Number 18. Throughout their lifespan, humans go from having 300 bones to 206. One of the bizarre facts on the list. When staring at a small newborn baby, it may be challenging to comprehend that babies have roughly 300 bones, and those bones are developing and altering shape daily. On the other hand, adults have 206 bones, which account for around 15% of their body weight. So babies have roughly 100 more bones than adults. But how is this even possible? As the baby develops, much of the cartilage will be substituted by actual bone. The number of bones in a baby will decrease because many of them will fuse together. The fusion of these tiny and delicate bones occurs throughout the body. Number 19. The average nose produces about a cupful of nasal mucus every day. Snot, often known as nasal mucus, is a beneficial body fluid. Nasal mucus' primary function is to keep the inner lining of the sinuses wet, to trap particles such as dust we inhale, and to fight infections. Mucus also helps to dampen the air we breathe, allowing us to breathe more efficiently. The throat and the nose are lined with ducts that produce 1 to 2 liters of mucus which is quite a cupful. We naturally swallow this mucus which is why we don't realize we produce quite a lot. That's all for today. We hope you enjoyed this video, we post weekly videos, so please make sure you like the video, subscribe to this channel, and don't forget to hit the notification bell.